हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी कंटिन्यूस एंड डिस्क्रिट सिस्टम सो व्हाट इज कंटिन्यूस सिस्टम वी कैन सी दैट द एक्टिविटीज व्हिच आर हैपनिंग इनसाइड दिस सिस्टम आर प्रीडोमिनेंटली स्मूथ इट इज कॉल्ड एज अ कंटिन्यूस सिस्टम सो एज वी कैन टेक एग्जांपल ऑफ मूवमेंट ऑफ एक्स एयरक्राफ्ट व्हिच इज ऑकर्स वेरी स्मूथली सो द सिस्टम on other hand the system which changes are predominantly discontinuous is called as the discrete system well the factor system if we consider then the changes which are occurring inside the system are discontinuous and uh, <clears throat> in ordering of raw material or the completion of product occurs in the specific point in time so this is a discontinuous or discrete system what you can say so there are some uh, few systems which are fully continuous or discrete because sometimes one system can be continuous and that can be uh, discrete also as per the nature of that activities which are happening inside the system so here we can take example of an aircraft so it makes discrete adjustment to its stream when it uh, uh, for the altitude changes while in factor system machining produces continuously even at the start and finish of the job which are discrete changes however in most of the system one type of change predominates so that the system can usually be classified as discontinuous or continuous or discrete system